Hello there guys, welcome back to a short online tutorial. Today we're based in Adobe Photoshop and yes, it's your good friend Jack from Blue Sky Graphics back again to show you some really cool stuff. What I'd like to do today guys is show you how to turn any photo into watercolour art just using generative fill. A really fresh and modern effect that you can apply to any type of imagery within Adobe Photoshop and I guarantee if you follow the steps that I show you today, you'll be able to create some really cool pieces of work. First thing I would like to do to this image of this landscape here is make a selection across the whole uh, artboard. And we use the rectangular marquee tool to do so. And I'm just gonna come through and make a selection like so. You know, back there. And then what I need to do is press Q to enter into layer mask mode. And make sure that your foreground color here is like a sort of dark gray. Let's press okay. And then what you need to do is press Alt Backspace for window users, or that's Option Backspace or Delete for um, Mac users. And then what you need to do is press Q again to come out of the layer mask mode. And what should happen here, your generative fill should appear. And now I'm gonna type in watercolor. Press enter. And let the magic begin. Always make sure, guys, you persevere. It takes a couple seconds for it to work it out. And it is quite a large or sort of intricate image. So Photoshop takes a couple seconds for it to work it out, but the results are always pretty impressive. Also, as well, they have three different options for us to choose from. So um the results are pretty cool. There's the first one there. Pretty happy with that one, to be honest. Have a look at the second one, pretty cool. Have a look at the third one there. Uh, actually, I think the third one there is my favorite. And there you have it, guys. That's how you turn any photo into watercolor art in Adobe Photoshop. If you're interested in finding out more about the school, the courses that we offer, please take a look at our website at bluesquaregraphics.co.uk. Thank you very much, guys. Take care. See you next time.